Imagine a circle of fire encircling the earth, where powerful forces shape the landscape and lives are forever changed by the earth's violent movements. Welcome to the Pacific Rim of Fire, home to 75% of the world's active volcanoes and 90% of the planet's earthquakes. What is it about this fiery ring that makes it so dangerous yet so fascinating? Join us as we dive into the Pacific Rim of Fire, where the Earth's power is on full display. The Pacific Rim of Fire, also known as the Ring of Fire, is a horseshoe-shaped area surrounding the Pacific Ocean. It stretches over 40,000 kilometers and includes regions from South America, North America, Japan, Southeast Asia, and New Zealand. But what makes this area so volatile? It's all due to the tectonic plates that grind and shift beneath the surface, causing volcanic eruptions, earthquakes, and even tsunamis. In today's video, we'll explore the forces behind the Pacific Rim of Fire, the unique geography of the region, and how it continues to shape the world we live in. First, let's take a closer look at what exactly the Pacific Rim of Fire is. It's an area where several tectonic plates collide, pull apart or slide past each other, creating immense geological pressure. When these plates shift, the energy is released in the form of earthquakes and volcanic eruptions. Subduction zones, where one tectonic plate is forced beneath another, are the key to understanding why the Pacific Rim of Fire is so active. As the plate descends into the Earth's mantle, it melts causing magma to rise to the surface, forming volcanoes. Now, let's explore some of the major regions within the Pacific Rim of Fire and their unique geological features. In South America, the Andes mountain range is home to several active volcanoes. The region is part of the Nazca Plate and South American Plate Collision, which has created some of the most active volcanic zones in the world. Moving to Southeast Asia, Countries like Japan and Indonesia are situated on major subduction zones, making them particularly prone to volcanic eruptions and earthquakes. Mount Fuji in Japan and Mount Merapi in Indonesia are just two of the iconic volcanoes in this region. Further south, New Zealand's geothermal wonders and volcanic fields are a direct result of the Pacific and Indo-Australian plate interactions. But this region isn't just about natural beauty. It's also one of the most dangerous places on Earth. The Pacific Rim of Fire is responsible for some of the world's deadliest natural disasters. On March 11, 2011, a massive earthquake off the coast of Japan triggered a devastating tsunami, killing nearly 16,000 people. The earthquake was a direct result of the Pacific and North American plate movements in the subduction zone. Volcanic eruptions, like those from Mount St. Helens in the United States or Mount Pinatubo in the Philippines, have shaped landscapes and changed the course of history. When Mount Pinatubo erupted in 1991, it was one of the largest volcanic eruptions of the 20th century, spewing ash and gases into the atmosphere and impacting global climate. So why does the Pacific Rim of Fire matter? Beyond the immediate risks of earthquakes and volcanic eruptions, this region plays a critical role in shaping the Earth's environment. Volcanic eruptions provide nutrient-rich soil that supports agriculture, making regions near volcanoes some of the most fertile in the world. Countries like Japan and Indonesia rely on these fertile lands for farming. Additionally, the geothermal energy generated in volcanic regions is a significant renewable resource, providing clean energy in countries like Iceland and the Philippines. But living in the shadow of such immense natural power comes with its challenges. How do people in these regions prepare for the next big eruption or earthquake? Countries like Japan are pioneers in earthquake preparedness with early warning systems and rigorous building codes that help minimize damage. Communities living near active volcanoes often participate in evacuation drills, ensuring they know what to do in case of an eruption. Meanwhile, scientists continue to monitor volcanic and seismic activity in the Pacific Rim of Fire, looking for patterns and signs of impending events. 
Although we can't prevent these disasters, we can better understand and prepare for them. The Pacific Rim of Fire is one of the most geologically active and dangerous regions on the planet, but it's also a place of incredible beauty and natural wonder. From towering volcanoes to deep oceanic trenches, the Ring of Fire continues to shape our world in ways we're still learning to understand. If you found this exploration of the Pacific Rim of Fire fascinating, make sure to like this video and subscribe for more in-depth looks at Earth's natural wonders. And let us know in the comments, which region of the Pacific Rim of Fire would you want to explore? Subscribe for more geological wonders. Stay tuned for our next journey into Earth's most extreme landscapes.